We start at the state capitol tonight touting accomplishments while looking ahead. Governor Scott Walker says the state of Wisconsin is historically strong. Walker delivered his annual State of the State address this afternoon. NBC 26's Matt Jarko is live in Madison tonight with more. Matt. Regina, in what's now a re-election year, Governor Walker laid out to voters and lawmakers a long list of accomplishments in 2017 and his tenure in office. He says now the state needs to continue moving those accomplishments forward. Walker talked about proposals to invest in education across the state. He also proposed investments to workforce development, and the governor hopes to expand welfare reform programs. Walker says everybody on public assistance should be able to pass a drug test, but lawmakers are at odds about his workforce proposals. We're going to make sure that we turn this benefit cliff that we have into a slope, empower people to get off of government assistance and get back to work. The millionaires and the billionaires, maybe drug test the legislators. Anybody on the so-called dole should be drug tested then if you're going to push that. Why pick, people, why pick on the people in the end? Now, Walker's remarks today come as a long line of Democrats continue lining up to challenge him this November. Walker already has nine Democratic opponents, and party lawmakers we spoke with say this speech from the governor felt like a man running for re-election. Republican lawmakers, however, disagreed. They say Walker is laying out proposals that can help the state for years to come. Keeping you connected from the state capitol, Matt Jarko, NBC 26.